All right, I'm gonna give a couple examples on how to tell what printing your book is. And in there I'm gonna have different books to show you how it looks in different places. This isn't gonna cover everything, but it'll give you kind of an idea. So this is The Great Hunt by Robert Jordan. It's the paperback version. And in here, you can see in the number line, we're gonna take the lowest number here, and that's gonna be a 10. So this is going to be first mass market edition, 10th printing. Let's look at our next one. Oh, I forgot to, oh, there it is. I put fancy bookmarks in here. I ripped up a envelope. You're welcome. So this is going to be Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. This is the most, these Harry Potter books are the most errors I find on eBay because a lot of people get these books and they hit sell similar and they aren't paying attention or they don't know how to read the number line, which when I first started selling books, I sure as heck didn't know what I was doing. So I just wanna give some tips. This is going to be Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. It is the first American edition. It's not on this seventh printing. I noticed it in others. And it's a seventh printing. It's going to be the lowest number in this line over here. Fun fact about this book, it actually has the first issue of the dust jacket. It has the error here. There's no year two badge, which was added in the next issue of the dust jacket. So the most valuable of the American edition of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets is a first edition first printing and has the first issue of the dust jacket. Next, we're going to look at Stephen King Skeleton Crew. So this one here is going to be a first edition, first printing. And we're going to look at the number line over here, which is, it's messing with me because their copyrights are typically over here. So this is weird for me. And we're going to look again at the lowest number in this line. And this is going to be a first printing of Stephen King's Skeleton Crew. Next, we're going to look at Robert Rourke's, I might have butchered that name, Uhuru. Um, it's a novel of Africa today. This is going to be a first edition stated second printing. So it's really awesome when it just says it for you. I just picked this book up and I'm so excited about it. It's not that valuable and it's not super special because of what printing it is. But I've been wanting to find this book in the wild Every time I get to find a new version or a new book in the wild that I've wanted to see, I get excited. The One of the most recent ones I did was I'd found a third printing. I think it was a third printing of Jurassic Park. It wasn't, you know, it wasn't a million dollar fine, but I was super stoked. So let's look at The Vampire Lestat by Anne Rice. And this one's going to be fifth printing right here. So this is again, another really nice way for them to show you. Not all books are gonna be like this, but I hope that helped a little bit on how to find printings in books.